Hello everyone, welcome to Hot Cocoa Crochet. So yesterday I hit the yarn jackpot. Now I was going to record this video when I got out of work yesterday as soon as I got home, but because I didn't get home till later, it ended up being too dark for me to record the video because the sun was starting to hide behind the trees and with the lighting here in the house it just isn't that great. But today I got out of work earlier than what I was supposed to. So I still have that natural lighting from the window. So now I can actually make this video for you guys. But oh my goodness, am I so happy for my day yesterday. Because my grandma and I had lunch together. And we decided on our lunch we were going to go to Salvation Army. Luckily, my grandma convinced me to go in there. Now, usually Salvation Army doesn't really have yarn that I like when there is yarn in there. They have a bin in the back where they put all the yarn. So I went out there and I'm like, you know what? I'll see what yarn they have because you never know. And lo and behold, in this bin was Hobby Lobby yarn. And it was the I love this yarn brand. I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to have it. So you guys can might be able to imagine this. As someone who doesn't hoard, I don't hoard yarn. I'm a collector of yarn. I had a armful of yarn and I'm like speed walking down the aisle towards my grandma while she's pushing the cart. And I just threw it all in the cart. I'm like, oh my god, Grandma. They had Hobby Lobby yarn. And so I just grabbed all of it. There was only seven skeins. And there was plenty of yarn left over. But it was yarn that I didn't care for. But I was so happy with what I got. Now usually the color that I got, I wouldn't really go for purple or pink. But this color for some reason just stood out to me. Anyways, that was just the first of my little jackpot because I then went ahead, I was back at work and I spotted a coworker who I know crochets just like me and she's always looking out for yarn at Salvation Army or other places nearby and I told her, I'm like, hey, there was some yarn that I didn't care for but you might like that's at Salvation Army right now. And she's like, oh, okay, thank you for the information. And then she told me, she's like, oh, Merchandise Outlet. It is a series of stores here in Michigan. There's not that many, but there's still quite a few within Michigan. Uh, probably like uh, four to six stores, I'm guessing. But Merchandise Outlet is like a discounted store. And she told me that they just got a shipment in of yarn. Now, usually, I know they have a little tiny yarn section, but usually it's just plain yarn that, same old yarn that I just didn't really get. But she told me, she's like, they have Karen Cake yarn. I'm like, what? So I'm like, man, I'm going to have to check that out. So after work yesterday, I made my way to Merchandise Outlet. Found the yarn section there, and lo and behold, this big section was Karen Baby Cake yarn. Now, I'm pretty proud of myself because I could have swiped the whole shelf into my cart, but I didn't. I didn't do it. I'm very proud. And I decided to just go for two colors, five skeins of each, or cakes, I guess you could say, cakes of yarn. So I got 10 cakes of uh, Karen Baby Cakes, and they were only $2.99 each. And I don't know what the retail, original retail price is, but I'm guessing just based on the brand, and usually I'm pretty sure this one you would usually find at like Joann's, is probably around $5 to $6 each uh, before a coupon. But I only got it for $2.99 each, so I'm not really sure if it was a big deal in a sense, but... To me, it was. Anyways, I'm pretty sure you guys want to see this yarn. And I'll start off with the yarn that I got at Salvation Army. Now, the yarn that I got at Salvation Army, there was only two different colors. 
but the colors went together so I should have enough to make a blanket. It's these two right here. And they are I Love This yarn and some information about it, this solid color right here is the color Periwinkle and it has 355 yards and is 100% acrylic. It does call for a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook. And then the second color right here is color Sea Spray Ombre. This is the I Love This Yarn Ombre. And this is originally $3.99 each. So if I were to get all the yarn that I got, because there was four of these, and then three of this one, I would have paid about $28 before tax, but at Salvation Army, because they had it only at $1.99 each, that I was able to get it for only $14 and something cents after tax. So I was pretty darn happy about that, and I can't wait to see what I'll make with this. I'm trying to find a pattern for this particular batch here. So that was just my Salvation Army there. So I got seven skeins. And then with my other purchase of the Karen Baby Cakes, I got this color right here. And I try to do match my centers so that way uh, when I move on to the next skein, it will keep the pattern going the same way that it's supposed to. Now, for some information about the Karen Baby Cakes, let's see if I can find it. It has 231 yards. It is 82% acrylic and 18% nylon. It is super, super soft, by the way. Um, the color of this, which, does anyone ever look at yarn and you just see one in particular and it just reminds you of something and you would think the color would be similar to what you're thinking, but it's not. It's something completely different. And when I looked at this, the first thing that came to my head was Sherbert. It reminds me of Sherbert, but the color of it is Rosebuds. The color of this is Rosebuds and I... To me, it doesn't look like a rosebud sort of color. Like, yes, this part, but nothing really with the yellows. I think that's what threw me off. But to me, with it being pinkish and, well, pink and yellows, it really, it it's more of a sherbet to me. I don't know if any of you ever feel that way about a yarn before, if you've ever just noticed that the color just doesn't seem like the way that it's named. But I got five ski or five cakes of this color. And then I got five of this other color, which was this one right here. Now this one is called Dreamy Sky. Oh, and by the way, these call for a 5mm crochet hook. Now, it's the same details, uh, 231 yards. And, again, really, really soft. Now, I'm trying to decide what I am going to do because I tried to get enough of these to make something, like maybe a blanket out of it, just because of how soft it is. But my problem is I don't know what pattern to go for. I know I can always do a chevron blanket, but leave a comment down below if you have any ideas based on uh, a simple pattern that you might use for this kind of yarn. And even for my uh, Hobby Lobby yarn there, what would you think to use or uh, a stitch? Like even a simple stitch will do. I know uh, for solid colors, I like to use Alpine stitch. so. If you have a stitch in mind that might work out for this particular yarn, just let me know. Anyways, that's all that I got today. But as you can tell, I was just really excited to get all this yarn. It was not planned. It just happened to happen. So anyways, I 
Can't wait to see what you guys tell me in the comments. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And we will see you guys later. Alright, bye!